Hi, this is Tim from dvcnews.com and I want to give you a quick look at a new application for the iPad called DVC Planner. Um, it is the first uh, DVC point calculator available for the, the new iPad device. Um, you see when we start it up here uh, that it uh, has all of our resorts available to select. So we could select uh, Bay Lake Tower and it's going to ask us what size villa. So let's pick a one bedroom. And you can select the view as well. It's got standard lake and Magic Kingdom view. So our selections appear here now. And we can also select the dates. Let's go to 2011. Mm -hmm. Arrival January 1st. Departure January 12th. So we've got all our information set here. And all we have to do is tap on Create Magical Vacation. And it's going to tell us that for Bay Lake Tower, one bedroom, Magic Kingdom view, 11 nights, it's going to require 428 points. It's got the dates restated there. Um, it has the reservation dates. We could have called to book 11 months out on Monday, February 1st. Uh, if we're only booking seven months out, you'd have to wait till Tuesday, June 1st, 2010 to call and book. It's got some dining dates in there. Uh, it has the holding day. That's the date by which you would need to cancel this trip in order to avoid having your points go into holding. Um, days until the vacation. And you can add some little reminders here if there's things that you want to remember about your trip. Um, but once you've got it confirmed, you can save it. it Ask if we want to save the vacation. We'll answer yes. It tells us that it's been saved. And there's a button up here to view your saved vacations. And once you're in them, you can review the information. Um, and tap a link to email it to somebody. So it does a good job of storing everything right there together. If you want to um, play around with some dates, you'll see my information still in here. And let's say I wanted to uh, switch to a two-bedroom instead. Or, a, well, let's switch over to a lake view and see how that impacts the cost. It's still got the dates in there. Um, and we just tap on create your vacation again and it shows you exactly how the, the calculation has been changed. Um, now this particular app, I'll also show you that it works in landscape or portrait orientation as you move the iPad. Um, this app is also what's called a universal app, which means if you purchase the iPad version, you also get an iPhone or iPod touch version or vice versa. Um, and that basically works the same way. Um, you go in here and pick your unit size and your view and your dates. Just roll this forward to 2011. Departure date as well. And then tap Create Vacation. Oh, my dates are identical. Let's check out a few days later. And it has the same type of summary there. So it's it's a great app if you want to sit around and play with different resorts, different views, different trip durations, add a day, to subtract a day. Um, you can find out more about these two apps via the iTunes.